Hold up there, Marine. Let me see your nail gun for a second. Oh. There you go. I increased the rate of fire. That ought to add a little more punch to it. That's all I can do. See you around, Marine. Damn. Thanks, dude. That's not how I was expecting the intro to this episode to go. I'm Burning Dog Face, and this is Let's Play Quake 4. I thought I would just wait for uh, this guy to finish t telling me what to do, and then go, uh... You know, go with my usual welcome back spiel. Don't move. Go on, I'm done. Thanks, guys. Okay, so if I just sit here long enough, that happens. And I can't switch. Alright, I'm a hover tank. Bit on inauspicious beginning to that. Oh god. She took damage from that. where I'm actually going. I thought I was going over there. Yeah, there's a door. The fuck am I actually trying to do? Right, regroup with Rhino's squad at the Nexus Hub. Oh my god, this thing controls so poorly. I'm going to be fair to the, uh, Designers of this machine. And say it's probably that I am a, an infantryman driving an armored piece. Armored unit. Whatever. Spotlight. Nice. I'm... Crazy building. No. All right, I'll just kill you then. I'm doing all right.
Boy, that was a waste of uh, resources on your part. Dropping it directly in front of me. I've heard these turrets are real nasty. That doesn't actually appear to be true, though. That one didn't even finish deploying. Never be too sure. Apparently, some medics were fooled into thinking that a Strahd was dead. Just this morning. Oh god. That was way off. Cloud of destruction. Not annoying in the slightest! Oh! The hell are you? Well, I don't like that at all. vehicle locked means. This is kind of silly, I'm gonna be honest. Okay. Not in a hurry. Fuck 
you, whoever's in that particular part of the building. W right now. That's better. And the first Halo game came out in 2001, so yes, that is possible, but I really think they were trying to do that intentionally. into this one, but you can zoom into the tank barrel. Oh, you know what? Off. Okay. Section could use some music. Aqueducts Annex. You know, usually if it's called an aqueduct, it's because water is running through it. Oh, that's right, there is water on this planet. They had those giant fucking fish that tried to eat me. Let's make this go better this time, shall we? I 
wonder if that's a tank with Strog inside of it. Or if it's, uh... Or if it's a robot. And even it disintegrates. Oh, look at that. This uh, shield mysteriously went down as soon as it died. I don't know what the odds of that are. So let me just say, one of the things this game gets absolutely right is the architecture. After having played through Quake 2, this is exactly what I would expect a, you know, more high-res version of the Strog buildings to look like. It's just a shitty desert with uh, just the most industrial, practical buildings you can imagine. There's no joy in this planet at all. Seriously? Three fucking shells. have been able to take him out at all when I was uh, on foot. Nice! I actually really like that. Doesn't make them any more survivable once you hear the sound. Exactly where you belong, in a burning pile of scrap. And I'm in full health by the time I get to the end. I didn't even see an explosion that time, he just ceased to exist. I did a pretty decent damage, but... Human vehicles are made tough. There you are.
somewhere there's a uh, Strog engineer who designed these things. And he's being dragged away from his workstation in order to become a mulch. Missed. I had a dude who was in front of it. That's why I uh, didn't take it out. That's got to be the Nexus hub. And look at it. It's big and important. Robot hell. Oh. Oh, vehicle locked, press jump to exit. Wow, they had that on the screen the whole time just so they could manage this. Strog Stomper. Nice. All things considered, not the worst vehicle sequence I've ever enjoyed. I just wanted to hear what they had to say and then uh, call it an episode. Exactly how far behind enemy lines are we? Far enough that it doesn't matter anymore. What do you mean by that? We're completely on our own. You mean it could take several minutes before we receive any backup? No, I mean we aren't receiving any backup at all. We're cut off from the rest of the human forces. All right, Marines, listen up. The Strong have taken out the other convoys. We're all that's left. This mission's too big for any screw-ups. No one take any chances. No one try to be the hero. We're looking to get the EMP below the Tetra node brains of this facility. The Tetranode routes billions of strong communication signals every second from the Nexus. If that were destroyed, it'd effectively shut down the strong for this area. Once we get the Nexus down, our troops will have an easy time of it. The strong military will be completely disorganized. Boss out. Well, we don't seem to have brought the bomb with us, so, you know, good job there, guys. But, uh... Oh, never mind, found it. Oh, I guess that's what we'll be doing next time. Destroy the Tetra Node. Escort the EMP to directly under the Tetra Node and destroy it. That all about do it. I'll see you on the next episode of Let's Play Quake 4, Burning Dog fans. We've got to write ourselves a place in the history books. So until then... Later! <laughs>